Okay guys, so we're going to do some foreskin changes now because there's still a lot of highs coming out of the back and all the lows coming out in the front. So the base and everything's coming out of the front, but the highs, we need to get more base in the back here on these pods, these actual new pods. So let's see if we can do that. Okay, so I'm trying to get the best idea of how it sounds. So I'm recording here. I downloaded this app that kind of detects decibels and it gives you highs and lows, like a low, high. You can kind of see there where the bar changes, but anyways, I am just seeing if I can detect some lows coming out of the back and it's very little. Uh, and then also obviously when I put the fade to the front, it does much more. So let me show you here. Going into sound, fade, uh, putting it all in the back, I'm gonna reset this. In the middle, you can hear it clearly because there's a lot of the front speakers and the, the big subwoofer from back here that you can hear. But right now, the way that the system is set up, it has those back, it has those back speakers back there as uh, highs only. So I wanna switch that with four scan to lows. But in order to test it right, I'm gonna put the fade all the way to the back, right? Look, guys, we're gonna plug in our OBD Link EX down here. And then the USB part. Just like that. So the neighbors are doing the yard, so this might kind of mess some things up, but it might not be as accurate, but it'll still sound good. Okay, so we're gonna go into force scan now. Is that the right one? Yes, it is. All right, it looks like we're ready. So we're gonna go into the modules and we're looking for, put these in alphabetical, audio control module. I always try to double click and it's not double click. It is play down here. You're gonna hit the run play button down here, okay? Read the warnings. Okay, so first we're gonna change this right here. These last two digits here, zero, zero is no equalizer, so you have full range going to those back speakers. And zero, one um, is equalizer, so it automatically equalizes. And I think this is the whole vehicle, not, not just the back. It's the whole thing, right? I'm gonna test zero, zero right now and see what happens. So we're gonna hit right. Make sure you don't change anything else. All you're changing is these last two digits, right? And then right. Read the warnings. Cycle ignition off. Ignition off. Give it a few seconds for it to turn off. And then I cycle it back on. And this is hit okay here. Okay, so in 727.0102, that second set, that first block, the second set of numbers, I changed that to 00 instead of 01. I think it was 0901. We're gonna see if we can tweak it a little bit more. Okay, so now we're going to these top ones. Now these last two digits here, the B, I mean the two and B, and the first two digits here, control the speakers, okay? How much uh, power or ambage or what type of speaker it is. So like this two right here means that the front left speaker, the front driver speaker is both speaker and tweeter, right? This B means that the front passenger speaker is also both speaker and tweeter. Over here we have a one. This is the driver rear speaker and the one means it's only a tweeter. It's no speaker at all, just a tweeter. It's just passing enough uh, amperage back there for the tweeter. And then the four means the same thing on the passenger side, the rear passenger. If you have the subwoofer in the back, that. If you have a subwoofer in the back, it does know that there's a subwoofer there, right? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna hit right.
ignition off. Back on. See how that sounds. Okay, so if you do change the back speakers and keep the equalizer on, if you make it speaker tweeter but keep the equalizer on, it still won't sound right. So you have to remove the equalizer and make it speaker tweeters and it'll sound perfect. All right, try it guys. Okay, we're gonna go down to stop now. We're done here. And back to the very top and disconnect. And now we can exit out. Okay, we can unplug now. All right, guys, so that's that. Honestly, I wish I would have done that four scan mod before I removed those speakers. I think they would have sounded a little bit better, but regardless, those are four inch and these are six and a half. So the sound should be, the low should be a lot clearer on these speakers now. But yeah, I'm very, very happy with the way the sounds now because actually Bronco Ford, you did not do a good job with the speaker systems. The base speaker systems on these vehicles are not good at all. You have to upgrade, okay? Anyways. Thanks again for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Check out some of the other videos that I have. Peace.